I just saw those dehydrated mushrooms in the bag. I'm like, oh, this looks like somebody put some time into it. This must be good. It was the worst thing I've ever eaten, I think. And he's packing it out. Yeah, and I'm packing it out. I ate as much as I could. And you think I fucking dumped that shit out in the woods? No, I'm packing it out like a man. I'm talking about leave no trace, y'all. I can't wait to throw away that trash bag, dude. It's also got a, it's also got a butt, a butt rag in there that I was using all day to, to wipe out my swamp butt because it was so hot. I was putting it back in my pocket like a hanky after each time. Oh, and I wasn't even embarrassed about it. How did you just do it? Actually, I was a little embarrassed. I can't lie. Okay, we on day seven, about 8.30 in the morning. Me and that guy there, we've been hiking for at least two and a half hours already. Your boy was out of his tent at five o'clock making coffee this morning. Do you know why? Do you know why? It's town day. It's town day, it's town day boy. <laughs> Living in the woods for seven days. And now your boy is ready for the motel, hotel, holiday inn. Oh, we got a little bit of that on the way down to this mountain. Yeah. Oh, and we're going to go, we're going to do the bang bang. If you don't know what a bang bang is, that's when you go, you eat one kind of cuisine and then you pay the bill and then you go right to another restaurant of a different kind of cuisine and you get a second dinner. That's a bang bang. We might be doing like uh, Japanese, Italian, or maybe diner, uh, Mexican. We don't know. We gotta see what they have in Breckenridge. But Breckenridge is where we're going. Got a room set at the Breckenridge Inn. Yeah. Motel, hotel, Breckenridge Inn. <laughs> we're on our way down this mountain. We were just over a little, a little over 11,000 feet. We're going down into Breckenridge. And we got some of this on the way down. That's the dude ham up there. That's my fucking road dog on this trail, man. You gotta have at least one road dog in the pack. That's the dude right there. So, day seven, first video of the day. I think we go down, once we get to the road, I think there's like a free public bus that goes in between Frisco, Colorado and Breckenridge, Colorado. So we're gonna get on that free bus. Stinking or not? Stinking or not, we're getting on the free bus. More than likely we're gonna be stinking. But I mean, you've been on a bus in Wilmington, Delaware before, then I mean, then you've seen worse. You've had worse. Yeah, this is my turn. It's my turn to be that guy. <laughs> right. A little flowers there. A little flowers there. A little stumble here. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, beautiful trail, beautiful day. Gonna have a beautiful bed, a beautiful toilet, beautiful meal, beautiful resupply. And I tell you what, I don't want to even look at what I got left in my food bag right now. Seven days of just crushed up shit that I've been, been skipping over because I didn't want to eat it. Man, I'm going to that store. I'm getting some lunch meats to pack out, some kind of bread product to put in between them. I'm getting some eggs, I'm going to hard boil them, some salt packets. I'm getting some instant milk with some cereal. Hell yeah. Some fucking fruit. And that's how we're going to be eating these next few days on trail. You should have seen the slop that I ate last night. <laughs> Tell them about the slop, man. Huh? Oh, the orphan stew? <laughs> the, the, or, the castle, the castle yeah. gruel. <laughs> oh my God. This man ate a hiker box. Mystery bag <laughs> filled with cornmeal, but we decided it was cornmeal. So the, 
<laughs> At first we thought it was a couscous, but it was too yellow for that. It had to be cornmeal. Too grainy. It was way overwatered. <laughs> <laughs> Cornmeal, a dehydrated mushroom. Not a grain of salt. <laughs> no, not a grain of salt. I tried to doctor it up with some old bay. Mm, that didn't. It helped. It helped for like a, one bite. I couldn't even get anybody to take a bite of it. That's how bad it was. <laughs> My guys out here eating mystery bags. <laughs> like a rookie. But it is what it is out here. But today we're going to go to the Breckenridge Inn. Bang, 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 get cleaned up, be civilized again just for a day or two, and then we'll go out to just being the lowest, simplest form of human being there is, which is a through hiker. All right, y'all, nothing but love for you. You know it's gorgeous out when, when I stop to take the camera out on my way into town. Usually that's just head down, hike fast, and, and get there. But these mountains just don't let you do that. You come out the woods and into this. Think I ain't gonna pull the camera out and this comes up? Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Whew. Oh my God. Man. I'm about just a touch over four miles from town. It's 9.30 a.m. Done about nine miles already. A little over nine miles. So, uh, that's what you call hauling ass, okay? We hauling ass today. <laughs> Can I haul ass? Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Oh, oh my God. Like, uh, does life get any better than this, man? Short answer, I don't know. But if it does, I'm in for a good one. That's all I know.